Hello, brave readers. Welcome to our reading circle. Our book for today is Flight School by Lita Judge. Flight School by Lita Judge. Flight School. We teach birds to fly. I was hatched to fly," said Penguin. "When do classes start?" "But you, dear, are a penguin," Teacher replied. "Undeniable," said Penguin. "But I have the soul of an eagle." Teacher and Flamingo weren't so sure, but they let Penguin stay. Flight practice started immediately. Like this, flip, flap, flap, and up, up, up. Penguin and the other birdies practiced for weeks. At last, all the birdies were cleared for their first flight. One by one, they took to the wind. And then it was Penguin's turn. Geronimo! Rubble up! What happened here? I'm I'm sorry, Birdie," said Teacher. Penguins just aren't built to fly. How can this be true? Thought Penguin. In my heart, I live on the wind. But as he watched his classmates fly high above, he knew it was time to go home. Penguin was too broken-hearted to even wave goodbye. His teachers didn't know what to do. Then Flamengo had an idea. Wait! Let's try again. Flip, flap, flip, flap, flap, and up, up, up. Suddenly, Penguin was soaring above the sea and the clouds. Penguin was right. He did have the soul of an eagle. He just needed a little help with the technical parts. But however he felt inside, he still had the body of a little round penguin. But penguin didn't care. He had soared on the wind just as he had done in his dreams. He left flight school a happy little penguin. It wasn't long before he came back. Why did the penguin come back? My friend Ostrich has the soul of a swallow. Oh. Eep. The end. The penguin wanted to do something and persevered to do it, with some help and guidance, of course. Would you say he is very determined? Was there a time when you were determined to do something and then persevered? What was it? Whenever you're ready, share it with a friend or your family. Thank you for hanging out with us today, and we'll catch you later at our next reading circle. Have a good one. Bye.